But as I was saying, yes, when I rooted the game this time, it said on my file that we are 13% into the game, which leads me to believe that the game is not that long. Which, I don't know, I'm not sure what I what to think about that. Whoa, hey, what's up? What's up, buddy? Fuck you. Not really sure what to think about that. Oh, for this. Also, fuck you. Are, you. are you guys, are you monsters done coming, or...? Lump of metal, that is also useful. Nothing over here, doesn't seem that way. And yeah, the chain goes over here. Um, I guess I should let go? Yes, let, 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 let's let go very subtly. Got bodily fluid. I don't know how good or bad that is. I guess we'll find out. No, sorry, you can't really... Divinity Shard. We might have to use one of these later because... Well, if, uh, if we get too close to the beast gauge thing... Pulling the door's locking mechanism should open it. Alright, fair enough. Pull it then. Oh yeah, we did this before as well, huh? Okay. Guess I didn't really didn't need to explain that earlier. Okay. Opened it up, fantastic. Let's get in and break the chain. Let's hope that this is the only chain. Although, I am not feeling that it is. My gut is telling- yeah, one chain left. See? There's more than one. See, I'm, I'm such a- wow. Such a video game nerd. I hope all is well with Elena. Yeah, I hope all is well with Elena as well. I do hope you're alright, Aaron. <sighs> of course he is. He's as tough as they come. Yeah. He is, except when it comes to feelings, then he really doesn't know how to deal with with that. It's a ladder for emergency use. It has a switch to lower it. Oh, okay, so this is sort of like a, sh a shortcut. Can, can we target this? Can, how, how do we exactly, does this work? Can we hit it? Oh, we hit it, okay. Then there's a shortcut, fantastic. How exactly does that work? I don't really know. How about if we try using it? That, that might have been a good idea. From the very start. All right. Okay. So now we're going. We're backtracking a little bit, but we're on the right path. We are on the path to finding out where. Oh, there's these beasts again. What's up, beast? What's up, man? God damn you, beast! Fuck you! All right. Let's do it. Roll. There we go. There we go. Now this should kill it. There we go. Pull this. Beast flesh, and now we can proceed. Uh, although, wait. No, I think we can go back to where we were from here, right? Uh, hmm. All right. Yes, I, th I think it's a better idea instead of just you know climbing all the way through the other side. I think it makes more sense if we continue by backtracking a little bit from from this side. Like we opened up a shortcut for for a reason, right? Why did you do that? I didn't really. Whatever. Okay. Let's continue. Go. I, I'm, I'm gonna, just gonna ignore these guys. We can go down from here, which we haven't. Let's try that out. That might be where we need to go. Oh, I hate these monsters. Mr. Monster, I guess... Well, I can really target you because I'm too far. Oh, this, all of this is for an item? Well, better be worth it. Ooh. Level up. Nice. Nice. I guess uh, we level up from killing monsters? Is that it? I didn't, didn't know that. Alright, let's pull all of these. Nothing else they give me money, which I need. There we go. Alright, fantastic. Let's keep going. Alright, so some people in the comments mentioned that they think that Elena eventually will develop a taste for, for the flesh. I think that they're correct, because I, I thought of that as, as well. Like, what? what? Um, fuck you. That was, that was good. Alright, so what do I do now? Seven Leots, um, anything over here that I might have missed? Usually in games, sometimes, sometimes in games, they use the camera to hide items. Go up, there's an item over there, but I'm gonna ignore it, and now we can finally proceed. Alright, we can use this over here, toss it over there. God damn you, man, are we serious? Come on, man. Do it well this time. Are you kidding me, man? Just hit the goddamn... Thank you! God damn it. Totally much harder than it had to be. Okay, so let's go, go up then. Ignore this monster, and then we can go through here. I think this is... Is this where we came from, or where we need to go? 
Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yes. I think we need to go up this time now, right? Ugh, god damn it. Um, shake. God damn you, monster, let go, okay. So if I remember correctly, these flying mon- Come on! God damn it, now the chain is over there. Jesus, man. Thank you. Still not at ease with these controls. I don't, I don't feel at home yet. But I, may, I might eventually. I hope so. Alright. Oh, keep going, sorry. I have to keep pulling the chain. Let's go. This is like the most cumbersome elevator ever. If in real life we had elevators like this, this would be incredibly annoying. Let's go. But this is not real life. This is a game where things don't necessarily need to make sense. Okay, now I think we have to go down. Or... Pull the chain. No, wait. No, we need to do this. Okay, bring it over here. Probably need it for later. Now recover the chain. And this is get, this gets this. What? Another what? Okay, let's go down. I guess. I'm. I don't like how the beast gauge is looking. I don't like that. But hey, at least we're creating little um, shortcuts here. Attack. Attack. I said. There we go. We're creating little shortcuts. Can't really do anything with this. I guess it's dry or something. Go up. Go. God damn it, go up, man. Thank you. Getting a little shortcuts so that we don't have to use the elevators and waste less time next time. I guess we could go back and then return back here. That might be a good idea. I don't know. Hmm. I mean, we still have half a gauge left. I don't know if that's good or bad or, or what it is. Hmm. Hmm. How am I going to do this? Um... How am I going to bring something over here? Because uh, I have to pull this. How about if I do this? Get the get this over here. And then recover the chain like so. And Oh yeah, it works. Fantastic. Okay. See, my puzzle solving skills aren't as bad as they look at first glance. Sometimes uh, people think that when you're doing a let's play of a game, that it's the same thing as when you're sitting in your living room and uh, just playing the game. It's not, it's not, because, you know, let's players have to take a lot more into consideration. That looks like we're gonna have to swing on that. Fuck you, go into the wall. Alright, let's attack this over here and then use the chain over there. Haha! <laughs> Whoa! Build momentum and jump with B. How about this? Ha! Huh, that does work, fantastic. And this seems to be the master's. I don't know, chamber? Crystal ore. Let's destroy all of those. Fantastic. Cover that. Destroy those. And recover anything that might be in there. But the chains are still there. Where exactly do they lead, though? They go down somewhere. Oh, gonna take damage. Pretty sure I am. Okay. Oh, they go. Oh, so we do need to go down here. Okay. Let's go. Oh, yes. We are going the right way. I thought this was a shortcut, but it ends up not being one. It ends up being the correct way to go because we need to come here. Let's destroy this. Fuck you. Now this is a shortcut. Okay. But we need to come this way. Ooh, and you are new monsters. Okay. Let's destroy them. And there we go. Now I can maybe destroy you by... Doesn't seem like they're doing much. It doesn't seem like they're doing much. What can I do here? Um, and this. I don't like having four of them over here with me. Ooh, one of them is dead. All right, so it does. It, it is working. What well, my strategy is working. All right, so let's do this. Oh, roll away, because I don't know if that gas is noxious or not. I would assume that it is. What am I? A master of this game? Certainly not. Do this. Keep attacking. Now. Recover this one. Get what's over there. Some silver coins. Okay, keep doing damage. I don't like that beast gauge. I think the beast gauge fully replenishes when you defeat a master. But it doesn't when you feed Elena normal flesh. Which leads me to believe... Come on, man. Recover chain. God damn you. Which leads me to believe that it might be hard. Like, later on, if dungeons start getting bigger... How the hell are we going to do this? Are we going to have to make multiple trips back and... Because, you know, you can only feed her one piece of flesh and then it rots 
if, if, like, if you wait a few hours, it rots. She usually, she usually can only take one piece of flesh at a time, and then she goes to sleep. Get the old note. Thank you. Anything else? Anything? Ooh, see? Aha. Uh -huh. An item over there. Got some merc mercury. All right. Anything else? Something over here. The research into the master of sheer drop spire is not easy. Observing its master flesh is a challenge. Still, we have recorded what we know. Flesh, hard to observe. The master flesh has formed on the back section. As the master is cautious, it will change the direction it is facing when it feels its back is threatened. Makes sense. It may prove easier if only we could grab hold of it. Capturing enemies. It relies on its sight to capture foes and can focus on threats and follow them. Once it, start, when it, once it targets a foe, it becomes aggressive and can throw rocks at them. Careless research could lead to casualties. We need to think more about the best approach. Fantastic. So basically we have to attack it from behind. Sticky mud. Get that. Attack this. And proceed through here. Can we go break the... Come on, man. The chain... We, we don't have a lot of time. I'm, I'm getting... I'm, uh... What's happening here? Do I have to shimmy? Seems that way. Should be able to creep along the thin edge. Can I creep along the thin edge? Ooh, like this. Go. Go, man. Okay, thank you. Have to press right, which doesn't really make any much sense. I, was, I thought we had to press upright. Okay. Alright, come on. We, we still have a quarter left. We can do this. We can do this. Let's go. It's, uh, wow, you almost missed that. That was terrible. That was a terrible jump. Fire ore. Like that. Alright, now pull the chain. Come on, we can do this. We can do this before the, the, the chain gauge goes to zero. That would just be catastrophic. I'm assuming the checkpoints help with that? Or, you know, checkpoints don't count if, uh, if you die by beast gauge? Open, come on. Don't put any monsters here. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Alright, there we go. Second chain destroyed. Now we can go back and defeat the master of the sheer drop tower. So how did you like the sheer drop tower? I like it. I like the first one better. I like the, the design of the first one better. Um, alright. Okay, whatever, monster. I don't really care about you. I just want to get out of here. Because it's... Come on. There are some items over down there, though. God damn it. Um... Uh, not what I wanted to do. Whatever. I, I don't have much time. I'm, forget the items. Forget everything else. I need to des destroy the boss. And uh, get out of here. Also, one thing I noticed. Xenoblade Chronicles is the only... G oh, but there's a chest. Oh my god, there's a chest. Ah, that was totally not what I wanted to do. God damn it. Fine. I'll, I'll be right back. I'll, I'll go back to... Uh, I'm not going to have enough time. God damn it, I shouldn't have fallen there. I'm going to use a, a shard of divinity and go back and feed her some some flesh or something, and then I'll come back and take all the shortcuts and, and meet you back where we were. I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, we have a cutscene. So I, s because the the affinity gauge is it's it's going down there. So I assume that we shouldn't let her get into the collared area in the beast gauge. That's what I'm assuming. As long as I can move about, I want to do what I can to help. The teachings of Ios. I wonder if I'm allowed to do what I've done. Hmm. Let's give her flesh. Yes. Um, let's give her the, the flesh of foes, raw flesh. I think the dripping flesh is better than the beast flesh. I'm pretty sure it is. It's rare. I've got to do this again. Yeah, I'm sorry. 